Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I put up a video yesterday that was a 4th of July look. And then I was, uh, when I was editing it, I was looking back at what I had done and I realized I really haven't done a red, white, and blue look for uh, 4th of July at all. So I sat down today and decided to play with what I had and see if I could come up with a uh, Fourth of July look, and I think I kind of got there. So um, we'll go ahead and get started and uh, get going on what we have here. Um, Start it with the Super Goop uh, Glow Oil with the SPF 50. So that's what I have on there. I did go ahead and use the House Labs. Um, I have mine in uh, Cool 50, so that's what I use for my foundation. As far as what I use for bronzer today, I went ahead and used the MAC, and this is the uh, light rosy radiant color. So that's what I have on as far as bronzer today. As far as blush, um, I went ahead and played with a couple of things. Um, I did go ahead and use the Face Off, and this is by Hard Candy. This is the color Who Is She, and it's pretty much red. In fact, I think I'm going to add a little bit more in here. Because I did go ahead and set it with a glowy powder, and I think that just took some of the color away. So we'll add a little bit more in here. So there we go, and that's a little bit more red in there. As far as what I did for highlighter, I played with two different highlighters today. The e.l.f. Halo Glow, and this one is in Rose Quartz. And so that's what I used for one of the highlighters. And then I used the Catrice uh, Supreme Rose Beam. So I went ahead and mixed these two highlighters, and that's what you're seeing today as far as what I have on. And um, I did... Uh, just by the dark nature of the colors that I was using, yeah, they did spread a little bit, and so I did have to do cleanup. And so I have the Beauty Pie. This is their corrector in light medium. And so I went ahead and used this, and I went ahead and added in the color pop pretty fresh on top of it. I don't think I closed any of these back up, but um, yeah. So that's what I used for cleanup. So the brightener and uh, the Pretty Fresh Concealer by ColourPop. And this one's by Beauty Bay. So that's what I did there. Okay, so as far as what I did for the lips today was I used the um, Oma by Sharon C. And this is one that you can get at Walmart. And this is the It's Complicated Gloss. And the reason it's called that is because you can use it as a cheek. Um, it, you can use it on lips and lip gloss that I put over it. I used the NYX, uh, the fat oil in Supermodel. So, yeah, that's the way that that worked out. And then to go ahead and do the eye look, where I went ahead and did the red, white, and blue, um, I did go ahead and get out the Glam Light and um, got out the Scooby-Doo palette, this one. And so it's holographic. It looks like Scooby there, and then you do this, and it's a whole game. And it goes back to Scooby. It's really cool that way. Um, but I did go ahead and use this to go ahead and do the eye look. And I went ahead and used uh, some of the blue over here for my base. Um, I did go ahead and use this, yeah, this blue right here um, on the outer corner in the crease. And then I went ahead and used uh, some of this. And that's going to be on the inner corner. Um, and actually, so this is going to be on the middle to outer corner, and then this color over here is going to be um, in the crease from the middle to the inner corner. And they're all going to be over this blue right here. And then I did go ahead and use this red, um, 
And this goes from the inner corner all the way out to where the brow ends. And so I used this, and then I went ahead and put this glitter over the top of it. I did go ahead and put this actually on the lid, and um, I went ahead and added in, I went on a search for white, and so used the white from this bright palette by uh, Beauty Bay, and it comes with the matte white, and I went ahead and added some of that in here to just go ahead and take that sort of nude color and turn it more into a white, which is basically what I did there. So there we go. Now we're now we're at the red, white, and blue. And so we've got a white lid and then blue in the crease and then above that the red. So yeah, it did kind of turn into an editorial kind of look, but yeah. That's kind of what it ended up being. And I don't know, do we need some more glitter? We might need more glitter because it is, you know, 4th of July. So give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay, back. So to go ahead and make the white a little bit, um, have a couple of sparkles in there. Um, I started off with this white by Beauty Bay, and then I went ahead and added in the Colourpop uh, tassel color, and so that is actually making it into a true white uh, with some glittery sparkles in it, because this one has some, um, yeah, has some glitter in it, so that's what I did there, and so I went ahead and added those two in to go ahead and get the white, and um, yeah, it's an editorial look, but it's fun. And, um, you know, it's a holiday where you can be as sparkly as you want because there are sparkles going on all over the place with the fireworks going up. So um, to make it more sparkly, I went ahead and used Sungasm by Catrice as my setting powder. And so that's what I have on there. And it's making me very much very sparkly all over. And um, yeah, that's sort of the way that the look came out. I think it turned out pretty fun. Um, I did go ahead and use the ColourPop uh, gel eyeliner, um, yeah, right under as far as a natural eyeliner. And then on, um, <clears throat> excuse me. On uh, the waterline, I went ahead and used the Emeride, the white pencil. So there's a lot going on here in this look. This is how it turned out. And it turned out to be a really fun look. Um, yeah, I think the 4th of July, yeah, you should be able to do something a little bit fun. So uh, this is a 4th of July look. And like I said, I hadn't done a red, white, and blue look. And um, I'm actually pretty happy with the way that it turned out. So I guess I'll see you after the holiday. And have a great holiday. Bye.